Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. As you can see here, I have my new Bennu pen uh, that I purchased for Fountain Pen Day. Um, and I actually never um, purchased from Trufi before, but I was looking around on Fountain Pen Day deals and um, I came across their website because they were having um, a sale now I don't remember if it was like 10% 15 or 20% off uh, the fountain pens but I came across this pen and it is their exclusive um, Venus's hair Bennu and I instantly fell in love with it then the box as you can see the box was a little beat up on the side so I'm a bit nervous but I think it's fine I don't think anything is gonna be hurt oh and they did come with a free ink with all I think all fountain pens that day I think the pens were like 20% off or something I don't remember um, but got a, a coupon here and a handwritten note and a fountain pen day bookmark okay so the pen interesting so it comes in like this uh, taco shell that's interesting what else is in here wow what oh wow i was not expecting this that is so cool so yeah so has it wow that's very beautiful oh i love this so it's an intro uh, to the inspiration of this behind his pen and it is an exclusive to trufi this is the birth of venus remember uh, studying this in art history class they were inspired by this um, angel hair um, crystal um, this is a uh, rutilated I believe it's a rutilated um, crystal and we're getting into the taco let's see what's in here oh wow it's so beautiful and much more like bronze than I anticipated to be like in the photos look at the flex in that and it's just so fun to look at and there's the clip cool um, top finial looks like that has the golden sparkles in it I just can't wait to just like put this in the sun and just look at it it's so pretty oh my gosh okay so okay so let's just take a look there oh okay so this is a translucent or transparent transparent um, nib section here and it's it's okay it's not like uncomfortable or anything and this is like a full length pen so I won't be I don't think I'll be capping this because I think this might be too too long for me so I'll just be using it like this without it capped at the back so it's a Schmidt nib in a fine point and it's just it's just a converter on the inside so Coco Shimmer arrived from Dye Mine and I've heard that this ink really pairs well with um, this pen so we will try it out get some towels and I ordered this from Blisket, Blisket Canada and here it is and the gold shimmer is all at the bottom so just want to make sure that I agitate the bottle like how do you guys all like this cocoa shimmer like do you have the cocoa shimmer and um, I've seen a few videos and they look great with this pen so um, <clears throat> I actually wish that I bought this in broad or medium just so I can really have fun with like the inks but um, I asked them 
to change my medium order into a fine nib and I don't know why so I guess I was just kind of like I was too scared to try medium and you know scared I wouldn't like it but now I regret not sticking with the medium but we will see like I have no experience with Bennu pens and I really don't know what to expect I don't know where my towel went, so so let's do a writing test. So the color is actually really nice and I really do agree it's such a nice pairing with this pen and it just brings out the pen's beauty and uh, it's such a nice match and I'm going to do um, a quick uh, writing sample just to see how it looks on the page. So guys, it's actually very nice to write with. The nib is very smooth. Um, I'm very happy with it. Um, you can totally see the shimmer in the gold shimmer in the ink. And I am very happy with this ink and pen combination. Um, it does not run dry in the nib and it's very smooth and uh, pretty wet. Um, so I think this was definitely a great choice and the ink is very as you can see very bronzy and it's like a bronzy brown and um, the nib has a little bit of uh, downward flex if you have any questions let me know down below but yeah I do like this pen although it's I don't know it's a little bit more on the pricey side and I kind of wish it was more heavy like it's I mean it feels very I mean I know it's plastic so it feels very light it feels very light and I don't know I just feel like because this whole thing is uh, like a translucent plastic material it would benefit from it being a little more heavy just to feel more premium but Maybe that's just me, uh, but yeah, I do love this pen and I'm going to have a lot of fun enjoying to write with this beautiful 
dye mine ink so thank you so much guys for watching and i will catch you in the next video